soup so what oh, oh ice very cream very good it's ice cream i think yeah. isn't it it is ice cream. ice cream i do love ice cream but it depends on what flavor okay so are we are we trying are we trying brands One brand Who's the brand? Who is it? Murphy's. Murphy's. Okay, Murphy's are nice. Murphy's I'm so excited. Nice. Irish ice cream. I feel like it's going to be like extra creamy because the cows here are good. Yeah, because of the grass. If there is brown bread ice cream here, then yeah. I will be a happy camper. I don't think I've ever tried the brown bread ice cream before. I bloody love it. Is it amazing? Yeah. Is Murphy's. Murphy's in Dingle. This is their sea Dingle salt sea one. Salt. Yes. Dingle oh. sea salt. Dingle sea salt, really? Oh, sea salt. salt. This is one that is meant to be divine. I actually haven't had the sea salt one before. Dingle, I love Dingle. Anytime I go down Dingle. there, you can get a deep fried Twix. Ooh. A deep fried Kinder Bueno. Oh, go How on. are you? Good night and good luck. Okay, so. I suppose it was made in Dingle, so they got the. They had to. No yeah. point in getting it from Ackle when it's right there in your front door. Hang on, look, before we do it, like, it is a little bit, like, strange to have, like, salty ice cream. It just looks very vanilla y. I can't imagine it's going to be very what's salty. The, what's the I said at the start of this that I didn't like plain ice cream, but this is actually lovely. Eat your heart. It's lovely. It's so it's lovely. Good. Yeah, so really, good. really good. I'm not getting any salt. Is the salt in the room with us? I don't, I think it's a distant memory. Where's the salt? Can you get the saltiness? The Absolutely. Yeah. Can you? Oh, yeah. I can't it's, at it's all. It's like creamy, salty. Sheer yeah. vanilla. Yeah. It's definitely ice cream, really. And I've tried creamier it's ice cold. cream. It's cold. It's cold. It is cold. Well, no, do you know what I thought it was super creamy? It's a very nice vanilla. Like, it's really tasty. Very... Is the salt supposed to be very subtle? Maybe we're just too uncouth for this, you know? What's a creamy salty? What I'm having. <laughs> I don't get any salt off Do it. you not? No. Oh my God, do we have any salt? Do any sea salt? salt? I'll just sprinkle yeah. a little bit more over it. I don't want to shit on them. It like, no, it's nice. No, no it's nice ice cream, but I'm not, it doesn't taste like sea salt, does it? It's a great game of hide and seek. Yes. Jesus, salt is the champion here of hide and seek, if that's what's going on. When I think of sea salt, I think of like crisps. No, see, like I think of like the chunky bits. It's not just like your average salt. Oh, don't, don't, no, 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 don't. I just don't like the idea of like eating chunks of salt in my ice cream. You wouldn't be going, oh, that's way better than Ben and Jerry's. Yeah. Or that's even Hazelbrook Farm. It's good, it's good. I'm, it's I'm, good. I have nothing bad to say. I mean, they should just call it vanilla though. I I sprinkle it on top or something. Yeah, I want it to be saltier. No, totally. Because I love salt on sweet things. Absolutely oh, slaps. Lads, I don't know, did we get a bad batch? It's got bits in it. Bits, 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 bits. Is this it? <laughs> Stunning. Oh my God. I'm, I'm actually so excited for you to try this one because I've had this one. Have you? Yeah, I've had this one. So oh, right, there's little chunks of brown bread. Physical brown bread and ice cream. Brown bread and ice cream. See, this is what now I Now you've finally lost your mind, Murphy's. We can tell the brown bread is in the room with... Oh my god, do it again! <laughs> this is a great it's thing. so cute! This is a great thing. Once we have our bread, it goes into the oven with muscovado sugar for eight hours to caramelize. And only then is it ready for the ice cream. Ooh, I love that! Caramelized okay. brown bread. Caramelized brown bread. Where did this come from? Like, I don't know. Do you know? I just really hope you like it. Now look, I'm not saying it's going to reinvent the wheel. It here. better. <laughs> right? I want my world to be rocked, Justine. Why <laughs> brown bread? The next best thing since sliced bread is, is ice cream with brown bread. You're just on fire today. <laughs> so good. So now that you good. said it about the sugar. Mm. I can get that now. It's mad. <laughs> it's kind of chewy. Oh, that's why I love oh, it. It's stunning. Do you know fiber in there? I absolutely love the fact that you can see the brown I bread. Don't. I feel like if you didn't say it was brown bread, I would be like, hmm, this is nice. But knowing that I can taste the McCambridge's. If you put this on top of bread and butter pudding. Oh yeah. If you could transport it and like give it over to anyone that you know that's like emigrated to America or Australia, like you'd put Tato and Murphy's in the back because it's just a little, it's so like homey, it's so Irish. It is. Mm. Do you like it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't think I do. I prefer the sea salt and the brown bread isn't doing it for me. It's so good. I don't think you, you can't be disappointed in what they deliver. Or if you drizzled. You know, like amaretto, the like almondy, like yeah. disarono, or like a bourbon. I'm you just trying to work with like a dessert team. No, I'm just trying to include, oh, you know, in, in all parts of my day. Oh, is it honeycomb? Is it 
honeycomb. It's honeycomb. Is it honeycomb? I see a yellow this could package. Be, oh, it could be caramel. Oh, honeycomb caramel. Honeycomb. Okay, yes. I, I can get on board with this. Yes. It contains two different honeycomb pieces, which gives it both a melt in your mouth caramel and a crunchy one. Ooh, melt ooh. in your mouth and crunchy. So they've got two. There's two. It sounds erotic. This is fabulous. The way they're doing their sweet flavors is how I would enjoy sweet things. If it's kind of like giving like 90 year old, like the brown bread, that like that is the kind of sweet stuff that I would really, really like. Yeah. This will be a good. This is going to be very good. Yeah. I love honeycomb and I love my caramel. I love crunchies. It smells honeycomb. Mm. Yum. I think I prefer the brown bread. I've had loads of honeycomb anyway, mm. but like, it's like, it's nice. Mm. Mm -hmm. I get the honeycomb. It's nice honeycomb. I'm not getting the caramel mine. I want more. I yeah. want more crunch in this. Mm. I want more honeycomb in this. That's much creamier as well, isn't it? It is. It that is, is creamy. creamier. It's creamier. Is it because of the caramel? Very subtle with their flavor. Like chewing the ice cream. <laughs> I was trying to like get yeah. rid of it. It's really nice. The honeycomb is really subtle, but I yeah. kind of like that. Yeah. But I want more honeycomb. I want more crunch because like the yeah. the brown the brown bread one was lathered mm. in brown yeah. bread and it was it gave You're us right, such a yeah. fun experience. Whereas I'm like, where's the honeycomb? Did you get a little honeycomb piece? Not yet. It's like the per like it's not like break your teeth. Smooth. It just it just goes. Yeah. 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 Instead of. Yeah. <laughs> if we could describe it, that's how it goes. Maybe it's their thing that they're like other brands are gonna like ram the flavorings down your throat. Yeah, they're very subtle. These they're guys appealing are to the slipping in, slipping out to the over sixty-five market. <laughs> exactly, which not enough people do. I got a crunch there, and that was yeah, amazing. That's crunches. what I mean. I need more. <laughs> that one bit there that I got was amazing. Oh, this is the best one so far. Easy, hands down. Yeah, I might just eat all of it. Mm. That's my push. palate, really. I feel like you're kind of similar. Brown bread, brown bread, yeah. Apples. I get concerned about eating apples if I ever have dentures. I don't think that's going to end well, but you can get your husband to chew them up and spit them in your mouth or something. Do you know what I mean? There's ways around. That would be a really. I'll come over whenever you want an apple. Sorbet. Yes. Very okay. So pink. I love. Hang this. on now. Is that? I think it's a sorbet. I think number. it's a sorbet. Yeah. Sorbet. Oh, is this a palate cleanser? Do you think? Don't know. This is this is the real deal. Do you like sorbet? I'm not really. I'm not a huge. I like them when you get them at weddings and they cleanse the palate. Yes. You know, instead of getting the soup. We were talking about our love of sorbet. Mm. So this is good. It's a good time. I yeah. love a good sorbet, sorbet at the end of dinner. Stunning. Yeah. I was going to say in at the end after a spa treatment. Oh. You know, they always give you sorry. <laughs> I said more treatment. I'm bougie over here. I'm a doctor. <laughs> What's in it? Raspberries and sugar. Good for the veganites. Spring water, raspberry puree. Sugar and lemon. That's it. Straight to the point. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh my god, it smells so strong. Like you can oh. smell it properly. That is absolutely delicious. Oh my god. Tart. Mm. It's very tart, isn't it? That's nice, I like that. Mm. Oh my god, full cold. <laughs> Sweet baby Jesus. That was brain freeze, but it tastes so good. Like for something in between meals. Just a small little bit of that. You're not a fan of that. It's really good though. Oh, I'm a big fan of that. It kind of tastes like a jam. Mmm, it's a jam. Give me the brown bread and put the jam on it in ice cream form on both. Stunning. We're winning. Like you can really taste the fruit. Like that it's is beautiful. I have to say that is hands down out of all the sorbets I've had in my life. That is the most, I'm not going to say a really nice okay. thing as your face is like this. <laughs> I don't mind it. Mm. I just, I don't really like sorbet that much. No, I'm not a huge fan of sorbet myself. And it tastes natural. It's not like artificially mm -hmm. raspberry. It's the real raspberries. I, I think know. I'm having brain freeze or something. <laughs> when you said it was like, well, kind of erotic. <laughs> Do you know what this would be brilliant for? Hangover. Oh my God. Oh, yeah. wouldn't it be brilliant yeah. for a hangover cure? Definitely. Honeycomb first, then the salt. Then this, and then brown bread. The brown bread still confused me. I think I need to have another bowl. Let's try it again. <laughs> I feel like a negative Nancy even doing this because they were all divine in their own way. But the least wow one for me was the honeycomb because yeah. I just wanted more honeycomb in it. But after that, all of them were equal part. Great. Yeah, good, good job. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah. uh, good. <laughs> Sounds reluctant. But I don't mean it to be. I'm still in love with brown bread ice cream. Mm -hmm. I knew the pressure was on because Kira never had it before, and yeah. I was like, "Don't let me down, brown bread." But it didn't. Of course it would. It's brown bread. How could it ever let me down? We have tried lots of ice cream on this channel and lots yeah. of sweet things. Yeah. There's definitely a playlist down there somewhere that you can click to watch us try lots of weird foods, yeah. and then we upload Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. We so you can bell, and we might have some merch as well. You can't get this hat, but you can definitely get other nice things that you can wear. 
صاف چیه؟ 